They're passing. What do you mean? They didn't like it. <laughs> Maya's fall made them a lot of money. I know. They won't even put an editor onto it? Pretentious, convoluted nonsense, uh, written by a sociopath. Oh, oh my God. Oh, that one was off the record. Just ignore that last one. Can't we just take it somewhere else? That was three different publishers. Look, it's a sophomore slump. It happens to the best of them. I spent two years on that. You can't take it personally. I bled for that book. Everything on those pages is me. How am I not supposed to take this personally? Look, there's one recipe for continued success. Repetition. When you find something that works, you need to give them more of the same. You mean a sequel? Or better yet, a trilogy. Maya's return, Maya's revenge. Send the kids to the moon for all I care. And Jesus Christ, can you deliver a love interest? It's like you don't know your readers at all. The, the guy should be brooding. But give him a puppy. How about I just make him perpetually shirtless? Now you think. Chelsea, I am dead broke. You need money? Get me something that will sell. Simple as that. Hello? I see you finally got your act together. What? The book. So you like it? Oh, I love it. No, it's, it's way better than that other crap you were trying to peddle. <laughs> OK, let's not go crazy. No, no, seriously. It's really great, really inspired stuff. Uh, it's not a sequel, but there's a market for this. Is this something you can sell? Are you kidding? I already sent the first few chapters to the publishers. <laughs> They're all eating crow. <laughs> we officially have a bidding war. And based on the success of your last book, we're talking six figures, maybe higher.